Make sure you watch this entire video. Absolutely free breakdown. We're going to have two games today, by the way. We're starting off with a little college bas basketball action. A little maction, actually. Um, Tuesday maction. It feels like college football season again. I wish. Um, looking at this Buffalo-Ohio game. And then we're going to be looking at the the uh, hockey later on today. The Hurricanes and the Washington Capitals. So let's... Uh, Let's dig right into this thing here and going to be very excited. So, first of all, a couple days off. You know I don't really mess much around with the Super Bowl. Uh, I did give a prop play for free on here and on um, Instagram. It was a push. So, I did over one passing touchdown for Jalen Hurts. He got one passing touchdown. But I said it was a very secure prop bet, which meant that even if – Jalen Hurts only scored one touchdown. We couldn't lose money. Uh, only passed for one touchdown. Did we expect him to throw? Uh, I mean, to run for three? Absolutely not. So we're going to dig into this one. Like I said, uh, make sure you subscribe to the page. Turn those notifications on. Hit that like button. Slam that like button, actually. And leave us a comment. Become part of the comment crew. Let's dig right into it. Corey Bauer, shout out. Raiden Puma, Zotspot, Brother Boomin, M Law, Richard Dawson, Kroniger, Chris McCall, William Camaris, Brett Boberg, Sam Pennington, Bradley Duvell, John Anderson, Kyle Hammond, Jacob, LFG, Carapino. All right, without any further ado, like I said, Maction. This game tips off at 7 p.m. Eastern time, so get ready and get it in. You know, Buffalo is coming into this matchup, trying to get back to 500. They lost their last outing 72-65 to against Kent State. They're 12-13 and on the year, 4-6 and in the last 10, trending downward. They're 26th in the country in points per game, though, 79.6. They shoot for 46 from the field, 33.6 from beyond the arc, 38 rebounds a game, 15 assists, but they're giving up fifth, almost 15 turnovers, so they need to get that under control, and they need to get their defense under control. They're giving up almost 78 points per game, which is not very good, allowing opponents to shoot 44.5 from the field, 34 from three-point line, giving up 14 assists, 13 rebound, 35 rebounds, 4.75 turnovers per night is what they're giving up. They get eight steals a night, which is pretty solid. They just need to stop giving up so many points. Now, Ohio, on the other hand here, they just won in their last outing against Akron, who is a solid team, 90-81. They come into this game at 14-11, 6-4 in their last 10. Three-game winning streak, 36th in the country in scoring with 78.6 points per game, 42% um, from the field, 37% from beyond the arc, 30, that's 42nd in the country. They get the rebounding done. They're not really turning the ball over too much, only 11.5 turnovers. Defensively, they're only giving up 73.9 per game, 44% from the field, 36% from beyond the arc, only 6.2 steals a game. Um, like I said, they have that win streak going. They're 11 and 1 at home. They're averaging 83.3 points a game on their current three game win streak. Great team. And Buffalo has been held to less than 70 points in three of their last five games. You know, Buffalo took the first one, 75 to 72. We expect Ohio to come out banging in this one, avoiding turnovers and securing the win. We're going with Ohio. Minus four, lock it and clock it. And guys, like I said, we have another one coming. Make sure you subscribe to this page. Turn those notifications on. Hit that like button. Leave a comment and sign up for a trial with the Sports Profits. I love you guys. I will see you in a minute for hockey.